Just thought we'd give you guys a little bit of an update on the Celica. Um, as you may have seen, actually no, we haven't posted yet, have we? Um, we got some custom cooling tees and stuff made for this so we could use a radiator. And uh, I think if we put in the video of what happened now. Crack it in, put it in. <laughs> that would suck. You remember, you remember when I was telling you not to force it? I didn't force it. Um, apparently paper mache. It's made from paper mache. Nah, that might be actually spillage. That's what I thought too. What about back here where it's dripping out? I can see it dripping from the bottom bolt of the fan. Like, literally it's cooling up on the bottom bolt of the fan and dripping down. Well, let's fill it up with more water and see what happens. That's, we're not going to be able to tell now, now that you've wet your turbo down. <laughs> well, I can't tell now because it's dripping off your turbo as well. Hey, don't throw it. Don't do Brad things with it. That is mine. Welcome to Project Celica, where it's never gonna get That's your fault. It's 110% your fault. I think that uh, that was enjoyable, right? You getting all angry? Well, got it. Um, so we got that radiator in there, right? We got it running. It was awesome. Uh, ran for about 30 seconds. Found out that there was a puncture in my brand new radiator. So we got a new radiator, put it in there, and we're going to see if it starts since it's been sitting here for so long. Do you want to try it now? I don't know. Go for it. Okay. <laughs> All righty, let's do this. Waiting for Brad to touch ground with the wrench on top. Of so looking forward to this. What? What I'm about to do right now? Yeah. You mean tighten up a bolt? No. You can tighten up positive. Hit the fender with it. Oh. So looking forward to that. If you've never watched a lube tech do that, you haven't lived at work. Are you still recording right now? Yes. Can you this copious mustache yeah. shots? Yeah, do one more. <laughs> give, give me a little. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and I never got it. Oh. You want a fender cover for that? <laughs> No, because we want to right. arc. Let's try it again. That's a good sign. It's, it beeping at me is a good sign, right? I don't know, is it? It's a good, yeah, it's very, very off. I wonder. If I disconnect it. Yes, if you cut power to an electrical thing, it shuts off. I don't know that this is power though. Yeah, should I leave it on or off? Leave it on. Turn the car off. I don't want to. I don't want to lose some fingers for this. 
Come on, lose fingers for the blog. The best vlog moment ever. Brad loses a finger. Oh, I like your, I like your uh, 80s. We're going to make sure that you don't accidentally not take your key out. <laughs> oh, you mean the lock? Like right. how, how it locks the key in? Like, no, you can't have your key right now. Start it up, man. No, he's talking about the lock the here. Lock. Yeah. There's a little button here where my middle finger's at that you have to push to get the key out. It fans on now. High fives all around. Selk is running. Big thanks to everybody in Ace Radiator for taking forever. Napa taking four days. <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing. Is that a 10 mil? It is a 10 mil. Give me. Give me. No. Makes sense, right? I, like, wonder, I wonder if I disconnect the fan. Well, that's not the because there's if no room. Over if I disconnect this fan, will this fan still spin? Yeah. Why would you disconnect so what I should do is take the radiator out and take this off. No, what you shouldn't do is take your radiator back out because then you're going to break it again. You know what you shouldn't do is remove fans. No, because well, the car's not going to run too cold. But I like showing his live. They're like, we put a turbo there. There's all kinds of stuff over here. But we have a fan there. And we need one over there. So why don't we put one over there? Hey, speaking of, I've never done it before, so I don't know how to change a headlight on this. You flip it up. Oh, wait, is it on now? Oh, wait, the brights are on. Sorry. You flip it up, and then there will be two here. Headlight bulb on this. Salka build continues. Uh Oh, one last thing. Remember, if you need racing safety equipment, go to bridgemoto.com and use the coupon code AFTERBURNER for 5% off at checkout. Remember, that's bridgemoto.com. Use the coupon code AFTERBURNER. That offers good through October 31st.